appearance provokes within me a stern wits. Your lack of remorse compounds and jeopardizes your blockbuster force. Birth of the nation, Oscar relation, your artistic creation doused by your penis's exhalation. Hormonal temptation lubricated into sexual domination. The college scene, Nate and Jean, cool and keen. Sex on their minds, rated across all lines. Prey and victim detected, her catatonic state got them quickly erected. Bam, 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 damn, son. Their work was quick and fun. High-fiving as they walked away, her pain though would always stay. Nate Parker, my brother, my brother, my motherfucking brother. And now today, to everyone's dismay, having had more than 15 years to digest, and those paragraphs were your best, the nature of consent, you said. Please, bro, don't hide under that weak ass tent. Your academic explanation that you were some campus black stallion sensation. You were some immature job patented rebuttures. My man, she was unconscious. Rape is a four-letter word. Any excuse is just absurd. You even can complain about how hard it's been for you. Your words only served to demean. For you, the future came as you pursued your fame. Meanwhile, she lays in the ground unable to make a sound. Your brittle acquittal, a moral abysmal, your legal lawyer twisted and jingle. Meanwhile, justice got swindled. But now at last, your victim's voice reminds us that you gave her no choice. From the grave, a sleeper agent, she whispers, pain is patient. My body was not yours to reckless. My brother, the bullet has been slow waiting for that Hollywood glow. Your film, though full of necessary politic and moral deposit, must be shunned because of your skeleton closet. There is no discussion or controversy. We must boycott without mercy. If we don't, we are an accomplice, and she will forever remain unconscious. Nate Parker. He ain't my brother. She ain't anybody's brother. Thank you.